has. Very sort of authoritative. Yeah, yeah. beautiful. <laughs> right, now the annual count of the Queen's Swans on the River Thames started today. It's called Swan Upping and uh, it plays an important role in conserving the animals and their young. The team travel in traditional rowing skiffs starting at Sunbury Lock this morning and then all the way along they will assess the young cygnets for any injuries. Let's go on to the weather. Somebody who's um, thought she was seeing rain clouds today, trust me, she was seeing something very, very different, which I'll let Alexis explain now. Yes. It wasn't rainfall. Very interesting today on the rain radar picture. We had what looked like rainfall, but it was actually flying ants. Yes. <laughs> Swarms everywhere. of flying ants. <laughs> In fact, they weren't down here, which is quite good because I really don't like them. But yes, it was a very warm day today. Alan Robinson photographed the sun last night at Small Doll in West Sussex. Paul Cobb took the picture here of the blue skies at Camford Cliffs, looking beautiful. And Lucy Lincoln captured a sunflower in the sunshine in Basingstoke. Temperatures rose very nicely today to a high of 26 Celsius in two locations in the south. That was at Otterbourne and also Middle Warlock and also Bournemouth Airport. Widely we saw a high of 25 Celsius and tomorrow temperatures may be slightly higher. So we are looking at some warm if not hot sunshine tomorrow and also Wednesday but the chance we could see some thunderstorms tomorrow night. More about that in just a second, but turning fresher from Thursday onwards. So with the clear skies tonight, we are looking at temperatures only falling to around 15 to 16 Celsius. So staying in the mid-teens, it will be a hot and a humid night, uncomfortable for sleeping with the light winds. Tomorrow's a glorious day at first. Through the course of the morning, we'll see plenty in the way of sunshine, but the Met Office have issued a rain warning. And that's through tomorrow afternoon, late afternoon and into the evening. Thunderstorms will start to push up from the south. Temperatures tomorrow could be up to around 27, maybe 28 Celsius. But then the thunderstorms, the humidity will trigger the thunderstorms tomorrow evening evening and they'll roll up from the south. They could be heavy, torrential rain at times, lightning strikes as well, as well as some hail and we may have some flash flooding in places. Temperatures tomorrow night only dropping to around 17 to 19 Celsius, so a very humid night to come tomorrow night, hence the thunderstorms. Now the thunderstorms will clear northwards during Wednesday morning. Once they do, we'll see further thunderstorms develop from the south during Wednesday afternoon and these are more likely to fall through parts of Berkshire and Oxfordshire, but there is a Met Office warning through North Dorset, North Hampshire, northwards. So areas north of that, that's where we're likely to see the thunderstorms with that Met Office warning. Highs on Wednesday of 25 Celsius. Thursday will start to feel a little bit fresher with the air coming in from the west and then Friday we'll see outbreaks of rain at times. Temperatures on Friday not as high as tomorrow, up to around 19 to 20 Celsius. So the weekend is set to be fresher, some sunshine but also blustery showers. Sally. We've got a bit of everything this week, haven't yes, we? Yes, of course. Thank you very much, Alexis. Uh, that's it from us. Uh, more at 8, 10.30. And don't go away, because coming up in literally a moment or two is uh, that wonderful documentary, My Friend Jane, here on BBC One. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye. Good night. Good night.